guys. So basically what we're trying to do right now is to go to this pizza place. He's, he's up in pasta and go back to the airport. But we gotta close this but we don't really know how to like close it properly. So <clears throat> we're waiting. What was that? Okay, okay. We made it to the restaurant. We know reservations, so we're we're gonna see if we can get in. I'll keep you guys posted. <laughs> hey. So good morning y'all, honestly it's really not morning, it's already 12 p.m. We're officially like the actual first day um, in Italy. So we're technically 30 minutes away from Sorrento. So day one, that's where we're about to head. We have to eat first, so most likely try to go grab something at a nearest convenience store and after that take the bus to Sorrento and visit so obviously I'm gonna bring you guys with me on this journey in Italy so far so good yesterday most likely I will put the footage but um, yesterday or last night we had the time to grab something to eat, so we ate pizza and pasta, and I believe I took the penne alla siciliana or something. Most likely we'll put this on a, 
on the screen somewhere but it was honestly 10 out of 10 would definitely recommend this place it's kind of technically far away from most of the things but if you guys are visiting um sorrento or like the area close to sorrento vico esquense and all of that other stuff then you guys are most definitely gonna enjoy that so stay tuned So we're now basically walking out the gate because it's like a quote-unquote gated uh, communities or gated villas. So that's the first thing. And there's a convenience store. I'm gonna try to see if they have some snacks available. I'm gonna do that, take the bus, and then go to that And y'all, I'm literally losing my voice. I don't know if y'all can tell or care, but I'm losing my voice. Just saying. And this is perfume of the day. We're doing Kayali. Always. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so we finally made it in Sorrento. We're about to like browse and walk and try to find something to do because we really don't have any real plans to be really honest so so you guys when we find something interesting or if i see something beautiful i will um vlog it of course i have to get this event this one is cute it's very good it's Can't even sit in peace Cause all of these niggas be on you I'm just saying I can be Yeah One that you call and you talk to Girl I'll share my world with you If you wanna waste your time Thank you. 
changé son, son visage. The water is warm. It's another brand new day. Yesterday I did not, well, I didn't really vlog to be honest. I was very much under the weather. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could still hear it in my nose. Sick like a damn dog. But we decided to do the famous Dolce Farniente day. So the sweetness of doing nothing. So we had breakfast. Um, hanged out in the sun, tanned a little bit, ate, um, what did we do? <laughs> did dinner in the house, and that's about it for yesterday. Um, today it's Pompeii, so that's basically where we're heading right now. We have to catch the bus in like maybe less than three minutes. So from there, it's probably like an hour, 45 to two hours worth of, um, you know, itinerary wise. So yeah, I'm gonna bring y'all with me. Bear with me today, but I'm gonna bring y'all with me. <laughs> okay, stay tuned. Okay, like usual, honestly, the views are giving, the weather is very hot, but you know, it's summer, so, right? <laughs> but, so basically we're renting a Airbnb. Um, we're now walking out the first gate, so there's the first one, and then there's another gate um, that is basically blocking the entrance to the the villa place or the villa department if i can call it like that so like i said we are heading to pompeii um to do somewhat of a tour to get to know the history a bit better and stuff like that so i will bring you guys along with me <laughs> Um, to discover and see a little bit and perhaps you guys will come here not necessarily like here you know because Italy is actually very beautiful and it's really big and there's a lot of things to see but yeah anyways stay tuned see you guys over there Oh my 
God, y'all. We've been waiting for this damn bus for like basically two hours. Okay. Mm -hmm. We understand a delay. We understand life. We understand a lot of it. But two hours though? So it means two of those buses didn't pass because it's like one bus every hour. It didn't come. Um, so we had to call one of the private chauffeur <laughs> that we have here. And honestly, when it comes to Italy, maybe not like close to the capital or whatever, but like close to here, we're technically in Monte Chiaro, to be more specific, right? Close to Pico Esquense and Meta and stuff like that. So I'm guessing it's a bit harder to get around here. They don't have any Ubers of some sort around this place. So the best thing is like a taxi or a private chauffeur to get around. If not, honestly, taking the um, any type of transportation that are like the public transportation is a, very much of a hassle. Like you might not even get in. But when it comes to the train, what? When it comes to like the trains and stuff like that, it's really not that bad. But when it comes to the buses, I don't think we ever took a bus that actually was on time. And you know, I understand the whole, you know, we gotta take it easy in Europe and everything, but like, baby, we got places to go. <laughs> Anyways, like I said, we literally had to call a taxi and private chauffeur because if not, we would have stayed there until 5 p.m. and we're not doing that. So, we're waiting. Because <laughs> it's already what? Almost 2? Mm. What time is it? More than 2. Almost 3. Mm. See y'all. And the thing, I think Pompeii closes at 5 too. Seven. So, are we going to have time to go? No, it's time at 7. 7? Yeah. Because, okay. Lord of mercy. Anyways, we're learning patience. <laughs> it's not an easy task at all, but we're learning, right? It's a learning process. Yesterday was a very um, lazy day. Dolce far niente. Dolce far niente day. Really enjoyed it, but today we wanted to like visit and be out, which we will still do, but you know, the time passes quite fast and still no transportation well now we do but anyways so now y'all know if y'all come around these parts the best thing is to have a private chauffeur or to know any line or to have plugs when it comes to taxis or you could do scooter if you want but we're kind of, we were kind of scared to do that because the heel is very like the heel is heel <laughs> okay the heel is heel i don't know if i can I mean, <laughs> oh. <laughs> so y'all can't really see, but the heel is heel, right? Same goes on this side. Can y'all see it? Yeah. So, yeah. See y'all if we get there. We might change plane and be like, you know what? Let's go get lunch in Positano. Let's go get some pasta and lobster. Maybe not because she can't do any of that. But, you know, yeah. Oh. Oh. Buongiorno. No refund delete. It's okay. Uh, Grazie. Yes, it's okay. <laughs>
hormones fait toujours un peu plus euh, frais. Plus frais, voilà. Ouais. So guys, we're back at the same, yeah, <laughs> we're back at the same location that we went to um, the first night that we arrived here, because it's like literally three minutes walk. So we're gonna see if they have any availabilities for two tonight, because we enjoyed um, the pizza and the pasta so bad. So wish us luck because we hungry as fuck i'm cussing sorry we gotta go <laughs> they look kind of full y'all but we we finna try it anyways we never know or if anything we'll just grab pizzas to go right right <laughs> miss solution Good, and before I go, cheers. This is for the video. Yes, grazie. No. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so this is day, I don't know which day anymore. Um, losing track of time. <laughs> Every time I travel, it's always the same. I think today we're Saturday, August 24th, I believe. And we're currently waiting for the bus once again. Right, but the chances that it's actually on time are very thin, right? Um, so we're still waiting because today is post Atano day, so we're gonna try to take the bus to post -Atano. Most likely get lunch there, and after we get lunch, walk around, probably try to get the famous um, lemon gelato. That, and then most likely we'll be back in the airbnb maybe that's like nine thirty or ten because if not it's a hassle we try to ask um a private chauffeur for like a price tag and stuff like that to see how much it would be from monte Chiaro to um positano which is technically by car like 40 45 minutes depending on how much traffic there is and he said 140 euros. And we're kind of scared to like do scooter. But I think it's one of the best and cheapest option. If not, I think renting a car, scooter, even a bicycle. But I didn't really see any bicycle to be honest. Mainly scooter because it's a long distance, honestly. Anyways, we're waiting. And by the grace of God, if we make it to Positano, I will show you guys what I see, of course, and show you guys where 
we decided to eat for lunch. So stay tuned. Ciao. So we decided to walk because obviously the bus didn't come on time. So every time that we were passing by, we saw this church. You know, let's see. I can see it. Anyways, we're like, okay, you know what? Might as well, since we're walking, let's discover around, right? There's a beautiful church, apparently, there's a beautiful view. And, guys. Y'all ready? Is y'all ready? I don't think I'm I'm hearing y'all. Okay. Let's go. Wow. Goodness gracious. So basically this is the church. Um I'm not sure I know the name of it. I'll see you later. I'll try to post it on the screen. But, wow, but the main star, the main star of the show, let's get closer to that, wow, oh my god, try to go to the beach still. Wait. We did it y'all. We finally made it to Positano. We're here. Um, we're most likely going to try to go down further down the hill and then maybe try one of their beach even though we did not bring any swimsuits. We did zero on that but whatever. So I keep you guys posted. We're probably going to go grab something to eat because um, I'm <laughs> so we're gonna go grab something to eat and then once i get there or whatever if i see something cute i will show you guys what i see like now wow you can't even sit in peace because all of these niggas be on you i'm just saying i can be that you call and you talk to, girl I'll share my world with you If you wanna waste your time Then waste your time with me I mean honestly Open your eyes and see If you gonna waste your time you what you need Then waste your time with me You could have all We're tired, we're sweaty, 
but honestly it is very much worth it to come here worth it but you'll definitely will have to walk you have to make sure to manage the proper transportation to get there and not get mad and overstimulated but overall honestly wow. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, grazie. Buon appetito. Thank you. Are they fun? You can leave us in peace Cause all of these niggas be on you I'm just saying I can be Yeah, one that you call and you talk to Girl, I'll see my world thing about this is it was my whole idea i was like oh my god when we come to Capri, we need to do this no who's scared mm. we made it to the top we still have to go down though, but we made it. <laughs> it's so gorgeous. Like, what? 
it's kind of ghetto to get up there but once you're there at this restaurant called I forgot I will put it somewhere on the screen um, just to really just grab a snack like fries right just fries Coca Cola some just to drink to cool off because we stayed um, in the sun basically almost all day after that we're supposed to go to Siam because now we were in Anakakri so on the on a specific side of the island and we want to go down again to the beach to cafe to really enjoy and lay down be in the sea and all of that so once I get to the beach I'll let you guys know
We had to go and stop to get some souvenir. I took a few of these and some fridge magnets. We're still walking to see what we see. It is super hot, but right here, the AC is, is given. Mm -hmm. Anyways. <laughs> basically our last full day in Rome we're heading to a cooking class where we're gonna learn to make pasta and tiramisu so we're actually really excited for that and then for the rest of the day we're most likely gonna freestyle and we'll see what we feel like doing if we want to go like visit the mall if we want to eat something we'll see and I'll bring you guys with me along this journey and this adventure. So stay tuned and thank you for watching. Grazie. 
<laughs> um, can you behave? Because I'm vlogging. A show. <laughs> anyway. Not my good sis acting brand new because I'm vlogging. So we're being disrespectful. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not acting brand new. <laughs> bye. Okay, y'all, um, back to business. So we're currently boarding. We're heading back home. We had a blast. Um, I would say overall, um, when it comes to Italy, one of my favorite places that we went to was Posta Tunnel. Um, especially when it comes to like the views and how it was and how aesthetically pleasing it was to be over there. So it's one of the top places that I would recommend. Rome is really nice and I feel like it's, since it's like the capital, it's a big city. Um, it's like easy to get around. You have Ubers free now available. So it's like easy to get around trains and buses all over town. But my favorite place was Costa Town. Costa Town is a bit not as easy to get around. It's maybe like by foot, honestly, or small car or scooter or something. But yeah, overall, we had a great time. The food was actually really good. I'm not a super big fan of pasta, but honestly, I really enjoyed myself. The food was good as well. Like I said, I'm really feeling myself. The pasta was good, pizza, and yeah. So looking forward to the next adventure. I don't really know exactly where I'm heading next and when that would be. But thank you so much for watching and until next time. She not even woman, more like a safer friend to me. Uh-huh. Plus when I'm out of town, always think of all my